Greetings friends and welcome to the midweek video. So, um, yeah, I didn't get to a, uh, a video on Monday. It was super busy. Actually, I haven't even shaved since Sunday. It's just been really, really busy. And uh, so anyway, here we are in the den. We're going to do a uh, video. We're going to do a tag challenge. I'm going to get the paintbrush challenge done. And it's going to be a music Wednesday. I finally got my song finished. Thankfully. <laughs> it's working on this one for like three weeks. The drum tracks still aren't perfect, but they're a reasonable facsimile of what a drum track on the song would be. Uh, soap we're going with is going to be MLS Shaving. That is Maddie Lindholm out of Sweden. And this is Black Osa Spirit. Oh, I love the scent on this. I figured this is also a good time to show you guys how I use this. So as you can see, it's a little chewed up. All I do with this soap is I break off a chunk, a good sized little chunk. That's probably more than enough. I take my handy dandy lather bowl from Thirsty Badger and I just put it down in the center. And then what I do is I spread it out with my finger. So I have a nice even layer of soap down in the bottom of the, uh, right in the center. And this helps load the brush more reliably. Now, of course, we're going to do a bowl lather today with the brush. But I think that should be that should be more than enough soap. More than enough soap, I think. So this could be a slightly longer video. Uh, I'm not quite used to uh, lathering up with a paintbrush. It's not really in my bag of tricks. And we'll get that wax paper in. Get this wrapped back up. I don't have any uh, any tins for a couple of these, so I just keep them wrapped as tight as I can in the original packaging. And I just stuff them in a uh, Ziploc bag. And seal them, and that should keep them good to go. So how is everybody's week going so far? Going pretty good here in the Red Island. This is uh, Fishing Eve. And there, that's all ready to be put away. This is a uh, fishing eve. Fishing season opens tomorrow. I can't wait. We'll talk about that more as we lather up. And here's the brush for today. A beautiful paint brush. Uh, one and a half inch surface. We're not going to shake too much water out of that. I think we're just gonna we're just gonna get in here and get whipping this lather and see how it goes. <laughs> Quite the challenge. I don't even know. I don't know who I'm gonna tag in this either. Um, it seems like it's floating around to everybody, and my usual victim is uh, taking a little break from doing videos. So yeah, I don't know quite how this is gonna work. And a little bit more water. It's a fairly stiff brush, so trying to trying to get the tips to splay and really agitate this lather is going to be a bit of a problem. Let's see if I can just mash it down in there. There we go. I was watching the Rusty Razor today. Uh, if you guys haven't checked him out, uh, there'll be a link to his channel in the description box down below. Quite interesting. Um, he was using his Chic Corona, which is a uh, a razor he's used. Since he started wet shaving like 40 years ago, I think. And that was like his original safety razor. And, it, and that's really, really cool. Because I noticed in this in this hobby, that sometimes in the Facebook groups, you see a few people that, um, you know, have just started wet shaving back when they were younger. And they and they never stopped. Uh, but for, for the most part, all, a lot of us, you know, we're, we're kind of relatively new to this game within the last decade even and uh, it's really really neat to see people that uh, you know have been in the game and this is the only this only way the way the shave that they know how this is the only way they they learned so I think that's pretty cool so if you guys want to check out Rusty uh, go give him a like and a subscription super cool guy this is actually whipping up into a lather it's taken forever though this is not really the ideal lathering brush but we're starting to get something that resembles a lather and I know this is probably painful to watch and you're like 
This is probably the time I should have the music playing, genius. And you're right, this probably is the time I should have the music playing, but how else would I talk to you? So anyway, so yes, Fishing Eve, the angling season opens on Prince Edward Island tomorrow. I have my angling license. I got my uh, locations picked out. There's a new pond I'm going to try that I've, I've never been to. It's the one we scouted. And uh, I'm just hoping there isn't a crazy amount of people there tomorrow. Because there's good access right where you park the car. That would be easy for me to fish from. Um, but that being said, everybody else might want to fish there. And, uh, but you can walk down on the other side of the bank. I might need my wife to help me get down there, but I don't know. And look at that, guys. We got a lather. We got a lather coming. It's just taking forever. I don't, this, this brush isn't much of a scrubber by the looks of it. But I think it's going to be a hell of a painter. Yes, I just did that. I'll be here all week. Try the view. Love the smell on this. Mm, 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 mm. This is the one that Maddie's uh, wife picked out. So this is basil, lime, and black pepper. Just a phenomenal scent. Uh, if you're looking for a splash that matches it well, I'm going to use male grooming Frankenlime today. Yeah, look at that. That made a hell of a ladder. Took forever to get there, but I think we got enough for three passes in there. Yeah. All right, let's uh, let's get this on the face, and we'll uh, we'll go. I said three days of growth today, so feel good to get this off the face. Leather is still a little bit thick, but that's okay. And we'll just apply it on there nicely. Get a little bit of a scrub into those whiskers. Cool. All right, razor of choice, going to be the Curve, Christopher Bradley in beautiful aluminium. Looks like we have the uh, closed comb. Uh, so the safety bar plate, C plate, brand new people's blade. That is the Wisimit Super Iridium. So we're going to cut this, I'm going to put on the tunes, and uh, we're going to get into the shave. So I'll be back in the second pass. See ya.
Okay, and I'm back. So hopefully you guys like that tone. Uh, it's called Relentless. That's what I'm going with for now. Um, I guess kind of a country rock tune. I dig it. I liked it. That was played with the uh, the Telecaster, too, to go all uh, countrified. So just do a little bit of a cleanup here. And I just lost my lather brush slash paintbrush, but that's all right for did that go? Oh, well, whatever. I'll find it when we're done. We're done anyway. There's a couple spots. Beautiful. Beautiful. Very nice shave with the, uh, the Wizomet, the carved aluminum. Or aluminum. My neck hair grows in about 26 different directions, so trying to get all of it is usually a compromise. But I think we will end with that. So we'll do a quick cold water rinse. Go with the post shave and let you guys uh, get on with your day. Uh, maybe a little bit of irritation on my lower neck. Other than that, it went well. So, uh, who to tag? I don't really know who to tag. Um, most everybody's done this already. Uh, Rusty, the Rusty Razor. Um, if you want to give this a try, then uh, consider yourself tagged. Has anybody tagged Maddie? I'm not sure. I don't know if I've seen Maddie do one of these or not. Maddie, if you haven't done one of these, um, I'm going to tag you as well. I think, and I know, I know Sig did it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with those two. We'll go with two tags, and um, so Rusty and Matty, and uh, let's see what you guys uh, see what you guys got. So I'm gonna go with the male grooming Franken lime. Just a beautiful blend of lime and a bunch of other stuff, and it matches perfectly with this soap. It's almost like they're made for each other. A little bit of a tingle. Nothing too major though. We'll take that. That was a nice shave. Nice shave. It took forever to get that lather made, but yeah, once we got it made, we're all good. Get a little bit of this splash into the shirt. And uh, it'll smell stronger a little bit longer since it is mostly citrus. It fades pretty quick. All right, guys. Well, that was the shave for today. Hopefully, you enjoyed that one. I uh, I thoroughly enjoyed that one. And uh, yeah, so um, hope everybody's a great rest of the week. If you're uh, new to the channel, liking this content, and you haven't subscribed yet, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It helps the channel grow. Helps me. Helps the community grow. So until the next time, my friends, be safe, be kind to one another. Most importantly, have a great day, even better shave. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace. I love you.